Hello everyone, I am Muhammad Rafiq. Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we will see fourth model or fourth question related to projections of plane inclined to both the planes. So what fourth model says in the fourth model or in the fourth question, the we will be having one pentagon. Anything you can have hexagon also. So in the fourth model, corner will be resting in VP. Oh, okay. Earlier models we have seen edge resting and corner resting both as well as in HP as well as in VP. Now this is a case where corner will be in the VP. Let us see what fourth question says. We have a pentagon of side 25 mm. A corner is on corner on VP. Its surface making an angle of 45 degree. Okay, surface angle is 45 degree with where with VP. Uh, okay, so till here we will try to understand the question first, then we will continue the remaining part. So we have one pentagon given to us of side 25 mm. It has any one corner in the VP like this. So one corner you need to take it or you need to keep it in the VP. The corner should touch to the VP. Then the surface making an angle 45 degree with VP. Okay. So corner is in the VP. Surface is not touching to the VP or not parallel to VP. Surface is making with respect to VP 45 degree like this. Okay. So here the angle formed is 45 degree whereas this corner is touching to the VP or in the VP. You can call it as on the VP also, it's up to you. Then the diagonal through the corner which is in the VP. Which diagonal? The diagonal from this corner which is in the VP. They are talking about this corner from here which diagonal is coming like this. You can take diagonal like this. To this opposite edge, it should be perpendicular. Okay. And at the midpoint. From here we can imagine the diagonal like this. So this diagonal, you can imagine it as a line. Earlier pentagon was like this, corner in the VP, surface was 45. Now this diagonal with respect to HP it is 30 degree to HP like this. So now 30 degree to HP means like this you keep or like this you keep. Okay. For better clarification, this diagonal I will take it out. Now this is a line parallel to HP. So this should be inclined at 30 degree to HP. As I said in projection of planes, we can tilt in this direction or in this direction, it's up to you. But make sure the diagonal from this corner should be at 30 degrees. So let us see what first step we need to take. What we need to do is the diagonal angle with respect to HP, it is like this 30 or like this the front view you may get. So the diagonal we need to assume 0 degree. Then it will be like this. Then surface angle also we need to assume 0 degree. So this is will be the your front view, corner and here edge. Wherever true shape of the object is visible to you, that shape or that view you need to draw first. So let us draw first front view. XY line. So it is not edge resting. Edge resting means we will take like this. Edge resting means edge resting means we will take like this. Corner resting means the problem will be like this. So here straight edge will come here corner first you should take let us see the pentagon assume this is the pentagon this is the corner which is resting in the vp a dash front view so dashes will come a dash assume one side for dimensioning purpose any one side so here the length is 25 mm mm no need to write because generally all dimensions we will keep it in millimeters it's better or preferable you put dimensions here why because here our projectile line is intersecting so i have kept you may implement this in your drawing sheet now this is the front view which we are drawing right now here okay so front view seeing from top here a then first B, then E, then C in bracket D. So this is how we have done. Front view like this. Top view will be one line if you see from the top like this. So this is here. Now surface. See surface angle how much it is given. Surface angle was given 45 degree. With respect to whom is given that is secondary. Surface angle is given 45 degree. That we will assume for the first step as 0 degree 45 to 0 we will assume and diagonal diagonal angle how much diagonal is making some angle 30 degree it is making 
that also we have assumed 0 degree now when it comes to restore the original angles as per the given question what comes first surface comes first then comes edge or diagonal whichever is given okay if it is edge angle then edge angle should be assumed 90 degree if it is diagonal angle with whenever corner problem will be the diagonal they will mention so diagonal angle you need to take it as zero this only difference you need to keep it in your mind and also surface angle is always zero whether the edge problem or corner problem is there so let us continue now surface is making with respect to vp how much 45 degree so in the top view if you see the line will go like this 45 degree and in the front view the shape of the pentagon will get reduced so let us see measure this length and here you need to draw same length at 45 degree like this okay assume this is the length 45 degree so this is c bracket d and this is end a now either measure this or mark here or measure this mark here this b point so b is near to a like that it will be somewhere here so this is b bracket e or b of e also you can see now project this points upward that is in for front view purpose and from here take it horizontally again i am saying projector lines should be thin and continuous whereas all front views three front views three top views should be dark x y line you can keep medium or light color it's up to you now a a a dash from here b from here b Take this two, you will be getting B, then C dash, D dash, E dash. Join all this. This is how we got second step, where surface is like this now. It is like this. With respect to VP, it is inclined, where corner A is in VP. Whereas if you see the top view here, one line is there, which is like this okay 45 degree so this angle we need to mention here i will mention here 45 degree okay so this is how second step comes in. now we will move to third step here for third step what they are saying the diagonal through a only because a is in vp so this diagonal should be at 30 degree you take 30 degree in this direction or 30 degree in this direction it's up to you once again i'm telling you so we can take, I will take it like this, 30 degree. Now, you need to enclose this in a box. This box we will transfer there. In the exam, don't highlight the box, don't draw the diagonal, all those things. This is just for explanation purpose. So box, we need to shift it here. Measure the length. It is late till time consuming process shifting and all those things because dimension measurement is needed as i'm not doing with the exact dimensions so you take accordingly so this box somehow i have transferred so a dash comes here okay. then measure this distance this distance here B dash will come, then measure this distance, corner to this, then here E will come. Similarly, this distance, height if you see, here point D will come or D dash, then followed by C dash. Join all this. So This is how we have transferred this diagram here, at where the diagonal AD, not AD, the diagonal through A, this is the diagonal through a is making 30 degree make sure you should verify this sometime what will happen they will student will draw the box in this way then at that time diagonal will make 60 degree because 90 minus 30 comes 60 let's project all the points a b c d 
in the top view. So once again I am telling this I have covered in the previous video also that A and E are closer. So if you are doing with exact dimensions it may come this side or that side doesn't matter you need to stick to your original measurements or original points. So let us see first joining A to A we will see one by one A line is this side as per our diagram so this is your A, da a dashes are in front view over now we are doing top view then B second line where is B here this one this is B then C and here is point C D common line this is the D then E this line E goes like this and from here where is E this is the E this is your E A B C D E join all this A to B B to C C to D D to E and A to E. This is your pentagon. Okay. Where A is in the VP and surface is making 45 degree with respect to VP and the diagonal from A which is coming here in middle of D and C is making with respect to HP 30 degree. Okay. If you have any doubts, please put the comment. I will reply. And if you like the explanation, please put like button subscribe and share with your friends thanks for watching everyone